Okay, so probably can't see me right now, but I just took a wrong turn because, well, now I'm a dumbass. Now I'm headed back down the highway. I gotta make a big U-turn up here. Um, I wasn't paying attention. It's 5:45 in the morning. I've been up since five. I went to bed at 12. I'm tired, but oh, it's gonna suck to turn around up here. Damn it. Um, I am, um, I gotta make it all the way back to the intersection, son of a bitch. Oh, I'm headed out right now. Um, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna upload any of these videos until, um, until I get back. It'll be tomorrow morning probably before I upload any of them. Uh, I'm not getting back, in, I'm not gonna get back home until probably, uh, hell, I don't know, 12, probably 1 or 12, 1 or 12, 11 or 12. Um, so, wait, can I turn around? Right well, I could have turned around right up there. Oh, well, I'm gonna go all the way back to the intersection just because, whatever. Um, I'm exhausted and I'm tired. I'll perk up here in a little bit. Oh, I can turn around right here. <laughs> My throat hurts. It has since the last couple of days because I've been snoring at night really hard. So, it's just, oh, 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 gotta stop, got no brakes. It's just a little icy right there. Um, no, I'm headed out of state, going to Nebraska. Fuck. Nebraska. Now there's cars. There's cars everywhere. I'm out of the highway. Yeah. There's so many cars. Um, but no, I'm headed to Nebraska to go pick up my next project. It looks a little worse than it is. I mean, it looks a little worse than I expected. Uh, I'm already off more. Um, but it's not bad. For, for, for the money, it's not bad. Um, it was, it looked a little better in the original pictures, which they always do because they always post the best looking stuff. They try to avoid certain areas, but I don't know. I, how's my truck already warmed up? I got heat now. Hell yeah. Um, but, uh, no, it, uh, it's not bad. It'll be a decent project. Um, it's a car, obviously. <laughs> I'm headed to go buy a car. It's not like a big giant reveal. Huh? It's stupid. But, no, I'm headed to go pick up a car. I won't say anything about what it is until, you know, show it to you or whatever. But, um, it ought to be fine. It, the money didn't come through the way it was supposed to, so I'm all, not going to do it all of it in two or three weeks like I planned. But, uh, I'm still going to get it done. It's just going to take some time. It's going to be mostly on my own time, but it'll be a project I can build from the ground up. And, unless it's bad. If it's worse than I thought, then I'm going to let uh, Paul buy it. Because he's going to buy it if I don't. So if it's too bad, I'm not gonna buy it, then I'll just buy something else. Um, but right now, it, it's the rear end that's under it, um, and the work that's already been done to it, it's not bad. It's got a four nine inch under it. Um, it's already got full tubs that'll handle 18 inch wide tires. So, I mean, that and the metal work, it's, it's worth to the, the two grand that I'm paying for it. Supposedly, we're gonna try to get cheaper, of course. We'll see. But either way, I'm gonna make the correct turn back onto the highway and then make the correct turn down towards Paul's house. And then uh, I'll see y'all guys later, probably film a little bit down the road. Nothing crazy, I'm not gonna film all of them while I'm with Paul driving because I just, I'm not much for chattering. I'd rather just drive, shoot the shit. But uh, all right, well, I'll catch y'all guys here in a bit later. Okay, so in the garage this is the first morning i've got it here i'm actually going to do stuff to it i'm not going to do much to it i'm going to get it up on jack stands or let's see <laughs> my garage is they're all angled down so it drains in case they flood or something like that so i had to uh chalk the wheel with the, the crib now i've got some rollers from harbor freight um that and a jack so i'm gonna get that stuff unboxed get it all put together get the car on a roller so I can scoot it all the way against the wall. Um, scoot all the way against the wall, um, get it basically back in the, the back corner or the front corner. Cause um, I think the first thing I'm gonna do, um, I really don't even know. Um, I can get the glass off the top so I can get it open. Um, I don't like filming in the you know, people around, it's weird. Anyways. Can't really see much. It's kind of dark in here. I've got to get, 
there's one plug-in. <clears throat> I've got an adapter for it, so I can plug in through it and run an extension cord all the way down the wall, or up the ceiling and down the wall here, so I can put a, a power strip right here and basically just run a couple big spotlights in the corners, the big stand ones, or even the ones you clamp to the walls. Um, it's probably actually what I'll end up doing, keep room off the floor. But <clears throat> no, the car is, like I said, it's a complete front half car, so I'm back half it, which we're gonna end up cutting all of that out because it's, it's bad. It's worse than it looked. Um, didn't notice that we were there. Probably should look more, but like I said, for the price, it's still a decent car. Um, my first <clears throat> big venture, I'm gonna, I've already got a decent money saved up. I didn't spend as much as I was going to, even though I spent a lot more than I thought. Um, oh, I've got a back half kit that I'm gonna buy that is gonna be a lot easier and quicker than us fabbing it up. So I'm gonna get that bought <clears throat> here in the next couple months, hopefully so we can get that welded and get the metal work done. Because as soon as I get all the metal work done and get it done in the back, finished in the back, then I can put it back in my garage and start saving up money and doing little things to it at a time versus throwing it all at once. But I was planning on keeping the AC in the heater box and all that stuff, but, you know, I really don't... I really don't think I'm going to... Um, the state that I'm in up here, it's not, <clears throat> it's not, uh, it's mild summers. The winters suck, but I won't be driving during the winter any because it's always snowing and slick and it's just not, not the best, <coughs> not the best thing to be driving during the winter up here. So I'm, I'm probably going to gut all that out. Um, I'll just take a blanket with me if it's cold. <laughs> but no, the AC, I always have the windows down in my cars. It's either been T-top or convertible, windows down no matter what. So I'll probably won't be, and I'm not going to be daily driving. This is not a daily driver. If I want a daily driver, fast car, or fun car, I'll, I'll go and buy one that's done. Uh, this is a project. Um, no, I mean, it's, it's a complete car. I'm going to get a boost pack from work today, or a jump box. I've always kind of need one. Just because, you know, you never know when you'd be stranded. I'm going to get one of the bigger jump boxes. I'm going to hook up the battery leads to it and see what comes on in the dash. <laughs> see what comes on. See what, <clears throat> nothing's going to work, of course, because nothing's hooked up. But just to kind of, out of curiosity, see what's going to come on. But there's, <clears throat> ugh. everything's here. All the connections, everything's here. <laughs> um... I'm going to, God, so many wires and so many connections and things. Good Lord. I'm going to do my best. I'm going to take all this stuff out. Um, <clears throat> the heater box, the blower motor, all that light stays on all five minutes. Um, I can still see anyways. I'm going to pull this stuff out. The heater box, the, air, um, the blower motor, all the AC stuff. Um, just to kind of clean up the engine bay anyways, because I, I want to be able to work on the car. <clears throat> it's never fun having to work around all that shit. So I'm going to pull that stuff out, plug up the heater core ho holes, um, get rid of any excess that's in here. Um, it's cold in here. Uh, the the uh, air cleaner's still in here. That's, that's hilarious. That's going to come out. <clears throat> I'm going to go ahead and pull the, pull the radiator. Um, I think it was cracked or one of the hose was, I can't remember. The, actually, the radiator looks to be in good shape. I mean, it's coming out anyway, so I'm going to paint everything. But <clears throat> the AC uh, denture is going to come out for sure because that's part of the AC system. Um, and it's definitely drained off. There's nothing in it. So um, <clears throat> there are all gases. But no, I mean, the car's not rotted, though. It's rusted, but that's surface rust. It's not like it's rotted where there's, you know, like the cars of North here are, they're just rusted through. You know, you got my <clears throat> no rot, no rot on the bottom. I mean, there's no paint, of course, but there's no rot. It's just surface rust from where it's set out. Um, <clears throat> but no, everything's here. Um, it's intact. I'm going to pull the rear bumper um, to get it off. So, because we're going to do all the stuff in the back, the hatch is coming off, the Rear bumper's coming off. Um, I'm definitely pulling the front because I'm going to paint the car right now. I'm just going to sand it down. 
uh, get all the clear coat off, send it out the best I can. Um, no air tools, no nothing. <laughs> Um, so it's just all going to be hand sanding and that's going to be, uh, that's going to be a chore. Um, so I'll probably just, when it gets time to wet sand it, um, I'll probably, uh, I might, I might see if I can trailer it to the car wash and pressure wash the piss out of it. See if I can get some, some stuff off of it, <laughs> but the inside needs to be pressure washed. It's like cat piss. Um, but no, I'm going to sand it down prime it and then I just spray some silver on it. I don't want it primered and that primered. Yeah. I'm going to spray some uh, matte silver on it. So that way it <clears throat> at least have some color on it. So that way it's not, um, not getting surface rust, flash rust and stuff like that. Um, now that I found, I found a place to get the headliner for it. Um, fairly inexpensive. Found a place to get all the rubber for it. No, that wasn't too bad. It's door moldings inside and out. These are shot. Door moldings inside and out. Um, all the the body moldings for the door, the, the trunk moldings. Um, and there's not much. There's not much rubber to this car. But <clears throat> the wheels are atrocious. I've got a set of wheels lined up. <coughs> Sorry about that. I've been coughing a lot. Um, I've got to get some junky tires on it before too long just to keep it inflated because it's gonna I don't know it might be alright on those things but no I'm going to um, get going here I've put off doing this long enough this morning it's kind of been cold outside it's warming up though it's gonna be nice today again but no so this is my project it's gonna be dim in here the first thing I'm gonna do is get all this like get the car picked up get slid over in the corner get a ladder because <laughs> I didn't do it when I had my um, I don't want to push it out in the driveway and then try to run up there with my truck and the dead be a, no I'd get run over um, I'm just going to get a ladder from Paul or from work or something like that and get up there and plug all that in so I can run the electricity because there is none in here um, but yeah so this is my little project it's my 1989 Pontiac Trans Am GTA actually I looked at the VIN it's a GTA model, whatever the hell that means. I guess it had the fancier package, but it's not fancy now. So, anyways, this is my car. That was my first, like, real legit project. Everything else has been cars that are pretty much finished or already finished. So I just add to it and build on. So, this will be a legit car <clears throat> when I'm done, hopefully. If I don't bail out and put it back on Craigslist. <laughs> but, uh, anyways, I'm out. I'm going to get going. I will see you all guys later. Um, like the video, subscribe, link, share, tweet it. Facebook it, whatever. Notification bell it. <laughs> Peace.